he was a self-made golfer. He was not a natural like Byron and, and like Sam. Now, he had to build a golf swing, and it took him a long time to do it. I think his secret was practice. His day of practice would be all through the bag. I mean, start with wedges, you know, work up through the short irons, break for lunch, go back out, hit some more. He might hit six, eight, ten bags of balls in the course of a day with a nice long break for lunch and, and a visit with friends. Uh, that was a work day for him. Striving for perfection, uh, tailoring a game to toward major championships. You have to have a major championship to give credibility to your other victories. And you have to win it in a certain way that people will remember it. Ben's a guy who said, the first guy I ever heard say, if you can hit three golf shots that turn out exactly like you planned them, you've played a good round of golf. I think Ben probably, after, after he invented practice, which Demerit always gave him credit for, he then invented golf course management. So uh, he did all that stuff, but he did it through sheer hard work. Good players all have something in common, is that they want narrow fairways, they want uh, hard greens, they want fast greens, and they want small greens. Then the ball striker has the advantage. Hogan's the greatest shot maker. Greatest shot maker, through the bag, all 14 clubs, whoever lived, no argument, I have spoken. For Hogan, even what he would talk, they couldn't make the fairways narrow enough. He didn't hit the fairways, he decided what side of the fairway he wanted to hit. At one point he won uh, like four tournaments in a row, three tournaments in a row. 1948, when he won the U.S. Open and the PGA in the same year, he won 10 tournaments that year, 10 out of the 24 he played in. Well, when I started this company, I was back there making clubs myself, and right along with all, all, all the workmen. And there's so many things that connected with perfection in a golf club. They know now how to make a perfect golf club, and that's exactly what we make, and we don't put out anything else. He loved golf better than anything. Uh, I worried about that. Maybe he would love golf better than me. Uh, but he managed to love us both. It takes what Ben had, which was a uh, heart, competitive spirit, and uh, a little artistry all through the bag. 